So we just bought another tractor. It's a 8870 Ford New Holland tractor. It's an early one. In fact, I think it's serial number 50 or 70 or something like that. Uh, 70. Uh, yeah, 70. So pretty early, but it's a nice tractor. It's got like 8,000 hours, so pretty well used. I would think it was made in the mid 90s, something like that. But it's uh, in good shape for the hours that are on it anyway. We've been running the soil finisher and just chisel with it. And it's uh, got new tires on it and they're really big wide tires, which is pretty nice if we get into the bottom ground down there that's a little bit wet. It's just a thousand PTO. We actually are gonna switch it over to the small thousand because it's got the big thousand shaft on it and that's not helpful for what anything we have. It's got a couple little problems, nothing too major. The remotes are leaking a little bit. We were we fixed those on our other New Holland tractor. And uh, I don't know, it's got an exhaust, actually the same place that rusted out on our other tractor, which we fixed, is uh, leaking there. Uh, came with a bunch of weights on the front, which we had to buy with our, from our, when we had our G170. Basically the same tractor as our G170, just uh, the bigger version. And it's only a 16 speed. So our uh, G170 is a European version. So it's got the 18 speed transmission. Needs a seat cover, not a big deal. It's missing the cover here, but we can uh, we can replace that obviously. Or it came with it; it's just not on. And we put our I already mounted the chopper monitor in here. It's only got three remotes, which is plenty. Our other one does have four, so uh, anyway, it's a pretty decent tractor. <laughs> Shifts really nice. Yeah, it's got 8,500 hours on it, so a lot of hours. But you can't, right now, everything's so dang expensive, it's crazy. So we uh, haven't been able to afford anything nicer and pay cash for it. We paid uh, 32000 for it. So it's about the top of my budget without getting a loan. But we needed something a little bigger the chopper and have two decent sized tractors so we didn't get rid of anything we just kept we're just keeping keeping all the tractors it seems like you can't ever have enough tractors anyway it's a pretty nice tractor for our setup and we're pretty happy to have it hopefully it lasts a long time without too many major repairs anyway we'll talk to you later thanks for watching if you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button below. And if you want to see more videos like this come up in your feed, please subscribe to our channel. And uh, if you want to find out when our next video comes out every week, hit that notification bell below and uh, that'll send you a notification when our next video comes out, which we try to send them out every week. Thanks a lot for learning more about our farm and we sure appreciate it.